Okay. Uh, so it has a resting. I live in a trailer park. Face. <laughs> and and uh, I'm from Gary, Indiana, buddy. I'm sorry. Uh, this guy is not buddy for me because I'm Venezuelan. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> Talking about how I look, who is wearing skinny jeans as a 30 year old is crazy. Um, okay. <laughs> you know, a lot of the time before roast, comedians will ask other comedians, like, they'll try and get dirt on people. I don't know Christian very well, so I was asking around to try and get dirt on him. And it's funny because every single person I asked said the exact same thing about him, and this is not a joke. Every single person said, I don't know who that is. <laughs> Shoot. What the fuck are you asking, okay? <laughs> <laughs> she lives with her two cats. She's asking her cats, okay? <laughs> uh, so it looks like uh, any girl on a scene where the police raid a crack house. <laughs> <laughs> They're just realizing, yeah, she sees one in the back, the one they slap, it's like, wake up, wake up. <laughs> <laughs> I know a Venezuelan didn't just say something about crack houses. <laughs> that is Colombians, you oh, racist bitch. Okay. <laughs> the citizens are talking. Hold on. Citizens, listen to me. Okay. There's a lot of news right now about uh, like Venezuelan migrants and everything, right? A lot of it is like hysterical. I wouldn't pay attention to it. But some things in reality are worse than what the news is portraying. Like Christian, he's Venezuelan and he came here and he started a podcast and he never shuts the fuck up about it. So <laughs> we're fucked. And you wanted to be in the podcast. Okay, episode six, uh, <laughs> look it up, okay. <laughs> uh, so I uh, just did a 23 and me and it turns out that uh, she's just a uh, broke bitch. Uh, <laughs> she didn't need the test, just look at her, okay. Uh, <laughs> you know I don't have a dad, why would you say that? <laughs> <laughs> but you have ancestors, like what the fuck? <laughs> Listen, Christian, you know, Christian, he's college educated, he's funny, he's a gentleman, he has a cool accent, he has a lot going for him, he can cook, and it's like, how the hell, with all of that, is he still so undesirable? <laughs> it doesn't even make sense. Speak for yourself. Okay. <laughs> um, so he uh, works in an Aldi in Aurora. Why are you laughing at that part? Wait. <laughs> this is personal. Okay. <laughs> she might be the only case of a white woman stealing Mexican jobs. <laughs> There's Christian. a Mexican who's not working, okay. <laughs> Christian looks like the type of, of immigrant, he looks like the type of immigrant who, the only American job he's going to steal is if the job is dating high schoolers. <laughs> oh, we have this job. Uh, no, it's okay. They grew up, okay. <laughs> so it looks like Pinocchio, if he really wanted to be a real trans. <laughs> Christian, if I... I love that he was a Trump guy. <laughs> if I proposed to you right now, you would say yes. yes. <laughs> because I need a green car, okay? <laughs> I'll say yes right now. <laughs> to you, to Peyton, whoever, okay. <laughs> Uh, Judge Judy, my hero, Judge Judy, she once said, if you were the prize at the end of my race, I would walk backwards. And I always say, if Christian was the prize at the end of my race, I would speed up so I can ask him, did you get that haircut on purpose? <laughs> no, but I don't have money for expensive haircuts. Okay. <laughs> uh, actually, Zoe, she's used uh, as an example for moms. They're always like, hey, you gotta study hard and eat your vegetable or you end up like her. I'm doing great. This is more hurtful than funny, okay. Christian, uh, he went to college, he majored, he majored in rice and he minored in beans. Um, <laughs> listen, I didn't. <laughs> listen. I'm sorry, I, 
I didn't want to do... <laughs> I did not want to do all race jokes, especially because you clearly don't fucking run at all. <laughs> and that's uh, Mexicans. You racist bitch for two, okay. <laughs> not every Latino is rice and beans, okay. I do, but it's okay. Uh, <laughs> the last one, okay. If NASA could only see soy chest from space, they would say, yeah, the air is flat. Is <laughs> not even mountains. Uh, Everest is a host to sell her more brass. Okay. <laughs> um, Christian is 29 or something. Uh, he's like 29, but he gives the vibe of a 59-year-old uh, undocumented mad scientist. <laughs> Sounds about good. Okay, I'll do it. <laughs> okay. See, yeah. Are you guys? <laughs> All right, you guys, give it up for them. Uh, yeah, that was a fun one. That was a fun one. As Christian learns English as a second language, we got to watch that live. That was exciting. Uh, all right, panelists, how are we feeling, Payne? Ruddy, we'll start with you. You know, TJ, you already lost your battle. You don't just to get put on something else pink and come up here and try again. This is from the shelter. Shut up. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I, I'm really, I feel really bad for you that your English was... Um, not good enough to win this battle, but because um, <laughs> your jokes were funny, but we were like, huh? Um, I thought it was great. I, I, it was pretty neck and neck, and then minored and majored in rice and beans is my favorite thing I've ever heard in my entire life. And then for you to just sit there and blatantly lie that not every Latino is rice and beans is... <laughs> I was like, yeah, 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 and black people are on time, and I'm skinny, and yeah, yeah. And I had a, I had a good set tonight. I mean, who are we lying to, you know? Uh, this was so fun, though. I'm gonna give it to Zoe, though. I think Zoe won this one. Yes, I agree, See the dude. guy is going for Zoe, I know it. So, yeah, dude. I mean, you do look like the last two battlers morphed into one. That was cool. <laughs> Zoe looks like your real doll that you bought. Um, you, you dress like... Okay, uh, you, look, you dress like a Latin extra chromosome. <laughs> uh, I wish the last one did better. But listen, I thought it was good. Uh, Zoe, you got the win. Christian, you were very funny, but Zoe, that, that big pop got you. Yeah, that was good. Yeah, I mean, Zoe, dude, she was like, look at this rice and bean motherfucker. <laughs> Which is crazy that that was the biggest pop. She had like all these well-written jokes. She's like, yeah, but doesn't he look like he eats? <laughs> <laughs> and then she had some joke, and I don't even remember the setup, but it ended with, did you get that haircut on purpose? <laughs> Which is the most fucked up thing you could say to this guy. And then everything he said, I was like, it's gonna take a minute for me to understand, but I'm sure it's decent. You guys look like you're wearing each other's clothes. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Zoe. Uh, Christian, you look like Jerry Seinfeld. If, uh, <laughs> if he shot the Old Navy. Uh... Now you can say something not racist, it's okay. 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 <laughs> um, <laughs> or not. <laughs> Zoe looks like a 16 year old pretending to be 25, and Christian looks like a 25 year old pretending to be 16. <laughs> <laughs> Man, this was so fun. It was so close, but I think also the rice and beans thing got it for me. So yeah. give it up for Zoe. She, she won it. Very fun battle. Yeah, this felt like a like a like a guy going to high school to try to pick up a young girl, but then he stopped because she was being too mean to him. <laughs> it was just so racist. You were like, I don't want you in the van anymore. Get the fuck out of here. Like, I'm keeping my candy for myself. And uh, yeah, I mean, Zoe won, but this was a great battle, great stuff. Yeah.